Welcome back. Continuing the news. In this evening's health report, Shamela Pullen looks at the advancement of teleneurology in Jamaica. Teleneurology involves the use of a virtual or computer-based platform to treat people who are ill. It allows for the neurologist to be in a remote location while the patient is at home or at a clinic or hospital. Stroke neurologist and chief medical officer at Andrews Memorial Hospital, Dr. Francine Gale, practices teleneurology. She says 50% of her patients suffer from a stroke and the others from conditions such as epilepsy. Currently, there are under 10 neurologists in Jamaica. Given the demand for care, Dr. Gale believes teleneurology can help. So for example, I was at a center in Canada. There were 37 neurologists at that one center. Let that sink in for a second. 37 neurologists at one hospital. Unheard of in low to middle income countries like Jamaica. In fact, if we do the math, in low to middle income countries, we have less than one neurologist per million. Dr. Gill contends that the advantages of teleneurology outweighs the disadvantages. And you can use cheap technology. So I often use the patient's WhatsApp video to see them. Or you can use Zoom, or you can use a high-end teleneurology platform. Reach. You're not confined to seeing patients only within one parish. You can see patients across the entire country. The patient's privacy is still maintained and it also allows for flexibility of their schedule. Sometimes I will see a patient on Sunday. Sometimes I will see a patient at 8 o'clock in the night after they have come home from work. And so we can accommodate each other based on the patient's schedule rather than saying, okay, I have to see you between 9 and 5. No you have the flexibility of meeting the patient's um, schedule. As for concerns about the absence of the human touch. So for example, at Andrews, um, Andrews has approved me to practice teleneurology within the hospital. And so let's say there's a patient that is admitted and that patient has a diagnosis of a stroke. They are under the care of an internist, so there is already a medical team that is involved in the patient's care. So that patient is getting the human contact. With your health report, I'm Shimela Pullen wishing you good health.